Hey everybody, what's up? Today in this video, we are gonna make flaxseed milk. Two ingredients, flax seeds and water. This is a lesser known vegan plant milk that's super easy to make and you likely have flax seeds at home in your pantry. Quirks. Flax milk has an interesting flavor profile. If you're used to drinking almond or coconut or soy milk, this is going to have a different taste and flavor. It's kind of bitter, grassy, or vegetal tasting. Another quirk of flax seeds. They are a mucilaginous food, which sounds really gross, I know, but they're similar to oats or chia seeds, even cinnamon actually, where when they're mixed with water, they get this kind of like slimy, mucusy consistency. I'm using a bullet blender, one quarter cup flax seeds to three cups cold water. Flax seeds, water, a pinch of salt are in here. I'm just gonna go ahead and blend this up for a quick 30 seconds up to one minute. Here's where flaxseed milk is different than other milk. Before we strain this, pop this in the fridge or freezer for 10, 15 minutes, and what you'll notice is there's gonna be a layer on top that's mostly like a flax egg. If you've ever done any vegan cooking or baking and made a flax egg, we're gonna scoop that off with a spoon and then strain it through a nut milk bag. It makes straining a lot easier and it makes the final milk a lot silkier and less slimy. Came out of the fridge. You can see there's a definite like layer of flax fiber here, flax fiber there. What we're gonna do is scoop off a little bit of this top section. I'm just gonna scoop. Again, you don't have to do this, this is optional. A lot of this upper bit is foam. It does just really help cut down on the sliminess. Yeah, look at that, that's looking good. Okay, so you can see that top layer is gone. Pour this in and try not to pour in this bottom section. So let's pour it in and we're gonna gently twist and squeeze to get all of this wonderful flax milk out. Taste test. Mmm. That's good. If you find when you're straining the flaxseed milk, you don't get as much liquid going through because the flax seeds are gelling together. You can add a cup or so to the finished milk, um, shake it to mix it together, and that should help you yield more. That also can help cut down and mellow out the flavor of the flaxseed. I do have more flaxseed recipes on the BLOG blog. Uh, flaxseed pudding, similar to chia seed pudding, flaxseed oatmeal, it's like a warm filling breakfast that you can have. Uh, so I'll link those down in the video box below and take a peek if you're interested.